I have a very interesting story and I didn't have a typical childhood like most people. I was born in St. Petersburg, Russia with spina bifida. But there was no wheelchair available at the time. My way of being mobile was to use my arms and to scoot around. For the United States, three gold medals in London, aiming for a fourth here. For me, mobility doesn't mean putting one foot in front of the other. What is mobility? We all might have a different perspective on what that actually means. I'm Steve Vasquez for UpRox, coming to you from Athens, Greece, home of the original Olympic Games and the cradle of Western civilization. What better place to host a mobility summit featuring world-class athletes and engineers from around the globe to help us rethink what is possible? I was an EOD officer in the Navy. Unfortunately, at the tail end of my Afghanistan deployment, I stepped on an improvised explosive device. I lost my vision as a result. When the lights went off, uh, another opportunity emerged, and that was to be a para-athlete. He do it as well. He's swimming straight. Bradley Snyder, the dribble, the 50, 100, and 400. After my injury, mobility was probably my biggest struggle. So I'm particularly excited to be here for the summit. We discussed a lot of different things from uh, the iBot, which is an advanced wheelchair, to things like Project Blade, which is uh, a, a synthesis of the technologies that are utilized in autonomous vehicles that might be used by the visually impaired like myself. My name is Robert Buren. I'm getting ready to be the first person to drive an iRoad, kind of the cross between a small car and a motorcycle. These hand controls allow me to drive the car with just my hand. The things that we're developing are just tools to allow us to see that person and allow them to be emphasized in life. Stuff happens to all of us in life. For me, what's important is how do I respond to it? If I can challenge someone, you know, to appreciate what they have and to push themselves, then something good is coming out of my injury. It's easy to feel stuck, like we're trapped in our circumstances. This weekend makes us realize that mobility is not just about being in a car or walking, it's how you get around. What are the tools that help us all move around better in life? Because at the end of the day, we're not stuck. Mobility is actually here. It is in between these two years. Part of overcoming the seemingly impossible starts with a shift in our perspective. <laughs>